Good afternoon, morning, whatever time it is, J.H. Kelly Folk. Um, today's video is how to make colors work inside a Navis coming from your Revit model. It's pretty easy, there's just a couple of, of rules you have to follow when you do this. Um, first thing you want to do is find your piping systems in your project browser. It's going to be under families, piping systems. So then you're going to find the system that you want the color to show up. Uh, the only thing I have in this file right now is domestic cold water. Right click type properties. And then the important part is right here under material. You can see it's got a word. Click on the little dots. These are the rendering material dialog. We should have most everything kind of pre-colored by a system name over here. If you don't, get with probably me to create a texture in your project so that way all of the color controls still function. Um, a couple things, once you have it selected in this upper pane, you see how my layout has items down here, items up here. Yours may not look like that. Yours probably has the bottom tree turned off has to do with check boxes that are in here. I don't know exactly which ones are which, but if you want to play in there, you're more than welcome to. So we're going to go to domestic cold water. By default, most of these have this use render appearance checked off. This needs to be checked on. Now, if you go over to the appearance tab, this under generic, this color is what will control it. Over here, you can't do anything. I don't know if you can hear me double clicking, but you can edit it when this is checked on. So I'll come over here and I'll pick the color I want my domestic cold water to be. We do have color charts for these, so uh, I'll try to include that in this email. That's going to uh, assign basically this aqua color to my chilled water supply now. So we'll get out of here, domestic cold water. You know, this name matches the name here. Go ahead and hit apply and OK. So you won't see any changes here. You can see that these are spooled objects. I've got a color override being applied to it for my own reasons. But I'm going to go up to Navisworks, or uh, external tools, Navisworks, test project is me. So this was my test project. You can see we've got some brick color assigned here and then I've got red. This was my existing chilled water supply when I started the video. So I'm going to go ahead and just F5 refresh and we see our new color. So just to recap, we find our piping system underneath our uh, families. We find the one we want to modify, right click type properties, find the material and finish, open the material and finish, make sure the names match, check on use render appearance, assign the color over here, and you're done. So if I change this over to being uh, chilled water return now, it's going to let me. Excuse me, let me go to domestic hot water, and it's really what it's supposed to be. Export again to Navis. And your pipes should go from blue to red. Refresh. There it is. If you have any questions or comments, uh, please don't hesitate to give me a call.